The Respondus Lockdown Browser is a custom browser that increases the security of online testing in Desire to Learn. When students use Respondus Lockdown Browser, they are unable to print, capture screen content, go to other URLs, or access other applications, including other browser windows. This prevents students from using instant messaging programs, search engines, or any other digital resource during the test. Upon startup, Respondus Lockdown Browser goes directly to the institution's login page for Desire to Learn. Students then log in by entering their Desire to Learn username and password. Respondus Lockdown Browser is similar to a standard web browser, but several features have been removed, such as the menu bar, the address field for entering URLs, the start button in Windows, and the system tray. Only the back, forward, stop, and refresh buttons are retained. The right mouse button has also been disabled, along with keyboard operations such as function keys and task switching keystrokes. The source code for the web page can't be viewed either. Once logged in to Desire to Learn, the course is selected, then the quizzes area. From here, the quiz is selected. If the settings for the quiz require that Lockdown Browser be used, and if the student is using Respondus Lockdown Browser, then everything will appear as normal. However, if a student attempts to start the quiz using a browser other than Respondus Lockdown Browser, as is now being shown, the screen will display a message indicating that the quiz can only be taken with Respondus Lockdown Browser. Notice also that the Start Quiz link does not appear preventing students using a standard web browser from continuing. Once the quiz begins, a student using Respondus Lockdown Browser is prevented from exiting the quiz until it is submitted for grading. Not only is the student prevented from going to other websites or switching to other applications, he or she is also prevented from accessing other areas in Desire to Learn while taking the quiz. Test questions can include images, flash files, or PDF files, just as with a standard browser. If a question contains a link to another URL, it will open a new secure window that won't allow navigation beyond that initial page. So, for example, if the content in the new browser window happens to include a link to a search engine, the student will be unable to access the search link from that new page. When ready, the student will submit the quiz for grading. It is now possible to exit the browser. All other applications that were running prior to the start of Respondus Lockdown Browser will be available at this time. It's easy for instructors to prepare a quiz for use with Respondus Lockdown Browser. First, the Desire to Learn administrator must enable the Respondus Lockdown Browser option from the Dome control panel. This will make several additional quiz settings available to instructors. To view these settings, select the Quizzes link from the toolbar. Locate the quiz and then click the link for it. The properties for the quiz are now displayed. Click the Restrictions tab. Now scroll to the Security Options section. Here you will find two settings for Respondus Lockdown Browser. When the first setting is selected, students will be required to use Respondus Lockdown Browser to take the quiz. Select the second setting if you additionally want to require students to use Respondus Lockdown Browser to view the quiz feedback and results. When ready, click the Save Quiz button to update the settings for the quiz. That's all there is to it. The quiz will now require students to use Respondus Lockdown Browser. Thanks for watching. To learn more about Respondus Lockdown Browser, please contact your Respondus representative or go to www.respondus.com.